Okay, this is the last part of the examples for section 2.3. So we have um, a physics problem. It says the velocity of an automobile starting from rest is given by the equation below, where V is measured in feet per second and T is the time in seconds. Round your answers to three decimal places. So here they give me the function. Now the first part says, find the acceleration after five seconds. Well, in order for me to find the acceleration at a particular time, I first need to find the general acceleration function, which means I need to find A of T. A of T is found by taking the derivative of V of T. Since V of T consists of a fraction, I will need to use the quotient rule. So low d high minus high d low all over low squared. So we get 400t plus 1600 minus 400t. The zero is not going to affect anything. And so then this 400t and this 400t are going to cancel each other and I'm going to get 1600 over 4t plus 16 squared. Now if I want to do part A, I want to find A of 5, which means I'm going to plug in 5 where I see a t. And if I stick that in my calculator, let's see here. 1600 divided by 20 plus 16 squared. Um, and it says round answers to three decimal places. So one, two, three, that five will cause it to round up. So making this 1.235. For part B, I'm going to find A of 10. So now I'm going to plug in 10 everywhere I see a T in that function. So 1600 divided by 40 plus 16 squared. <clears throat> and three decimal places, the two will not affect the zero. So it'll be 0 0.510.